mapema lakini nimekuja nimechelewa si kupenda kwangu nilikuwa hapa jana asubuhi nikapigiwa simu kwa mkutano kule machakos wa kaunti yetu ya Tanzania sasa hiyo ndio sababu nimekuja nimechelewa wale wananijua huwa sichelewi sana kwamba kura kabla sijasema maneno mengi kidogo kuna mjumbe hapa ye yeah, alikuwa mjumbe wa mjumbe anakuwa ni mzee wa hekima labda anaweza kuwa na neno moja tu la hekima mzee patrick wangamati A, amesema tu hekima yake ni kutoka kwa senator wetu david wafula wakoli ambaye alikuwa ameenda nje ajarudi nimpenda pia kutoa sima martin pepela ambaye pia amepigia simu akasema angeweza kufika hapa leo sema ya kwamba tupigane dhiti ya ujinga umaskini na magonjwa bado miaka sasa ningependa kuomba wananchi tuweze kusimama pamoja katika kupigana na ika na ningependa kushukuru governor Lusaka kabisa kwa sababu yeye ndio chairman wa agriculture committee kwa council of governors senator Wakoli ako kwa agriculture committee kwa senate lazima tuhakikishe kwa ujinga mimi nataka kushukuru sana sisi katika bunge tuhakikisha kwamba tunapea the highest budget kwa idara ya masomo. Tunataka kusaidia chuo kikuu chetu cha Kibabi na sisi katika bunge tulipitia pia sheria ambayo iliwekwa mkono jana na rais wa jamhuri. Katika zile fedha katika siti kuongea na OCPD maswala ya kuangalia upya nimekuwa kule mechimeru wana, wanasema kwamba kuna wakare wamekaa huko muda mrefu kule na vaholo wanakuja wanaibia watu wanarudi pande ile hakuna patrol zinafaa akaru tukasikia kuna kuwa na shida mimi na kuomba ya kwamba tuweze kupiga reshuffle tuweze kufanya overhaul ya security apparatus labda hawa wananchi wanaweza ya kwamba tuna usalama wa kutosha projects why because money is not trickling down to this county ndio sisi tufanye kazi nyinyi mnapopigania cdf yenu mjue kwamba as mcs we equally have to implement projects down here with the governor um, umesungumzia na si leo i think uh, basi hilo jambo la askari ambao wamekawia zaidi wale wamefikisha miaka tatu tutasungumza na makubwa yao tuone suluhisho We have, we have picked that one and we shall do our best um kuna mheshimiwa amesungumzia kuna bunduki zinatembea eh hata hilo linahitajika kuchukuliwa hatua ya haraka sababu bunduki nayo ikitembea hata inaweza kuwa moja lakini inaweza hangaisha kungoma mzima kwa hivyo wale wanahusika I'm sure the DCI wako hapa hiyo bunduki itafutwa kwa haraka ili waache kusumbua wananchi wetu. Um, alafu wazazi juzi nimekuwa pale naitwa Cheskaki. Cheskaki ndiyo umesikia mheshimiwa gavana akiuliza kama shule watu wanaenda kusomeshwa biology ya biology halisi sijui hiyo practical na ni ukweli wazazi walikubali wana makosa. Sasa kama tumejua pahali shida iko ni vizuri tuchunge watoto wetu. Vijana chungeni madada zenu. Kiona kijana mwanzako anaanza kutongoza msichana yenu mdogo kuwa mkali kidogo. Zamani nilikuwa naona vijana ungekaribia kulikuwa ni shida. Ni tatizo. Siku hizi mnaachilia tu Bungoma Bungoma muna mambo mengi mazuri. Na waomba tafadhali tusiharibu jina letu sababu ya mambo tunaweza tunaweza wachana naye. Na kuku ziko, tukuleni kuku, wacheni na virafu faranga. Na kuku zetu zimenona ziko sawa. Ni nini bwana inatuhangaika? Iko nini? Tunahangaika na nini na kuku zetu ziko safi? Na zimekuwa sawa. Na hata zinaimbiango nyumba mzuri mzuri. What's the problem? Hapana hapana tuachane na vifaranga dameni hapana 
na hii ujumbe sio hapa tu twende ni kila pahali nikimalizia na jana ulikuwa pamoja na kina mama na uka launch uh, manifesto bungoma women manifesto nataka nikushukuru sana maana katika hiyo manifesto inaelezea kwa undani kile ambacho tutafanya kama county kuhakikisha wamama wetu wanakaa vizuri na unajua mama akifurahi kwa nyumba hiyo nyumba yote iko na furaha so nataka nihakikishie our men kwamba you are well taken care of na ninaamini tutashirikiana kupigana na majanga kama ya mimba za mapema na gender based violence hivi majusi tulipata ripoti kwamba pia wanaume idadi ya wanaume kudhulumiwa iko juu na mimi nikasema hiyo ni sawa kwa sababu sasa mumeanza kujieleza sasa imeonekana kumbe kuna shida najua hapo samani nyinyi mlikuwa mkigongwa kidogo unasema pikipiki imeniangusha kwa hivyo leo mumeanza kuongea na nataka niwatie moyo tuendelee kuongea ili sasa tutafute njia ya kusuluhisha shida hizi na ninaamini pamoja tutafaulu kwa hayo machache Rangdi Bungoma County has stopped in matters of gender based violence and teenage pregnancy this is a label that we must reverse and do so collectively i urge our youths not to destroy your future by exposing yourselves to early pregnancies hiv infections or other sexually transmitted diseases the scripture tells us that good things come to those who wait so please be patient and you will enjoy your long life I'm reading this with a heavy heart because I cannot understand how one school can have 54 pupils pregnant. The question that we ask ourselves, which subjects are taught in this school? Is it only practical biology <laughs> with reproduction health as the main focus or they also teach CRE, history and other subjects? So this one we must address. It's a tag that I'm not prepared to carry as your governor. Then gender based violence what are those early teenage pregnancies the leading constituency is Kandui Mheshimiwa followed by Mount Elgon followed by very interesting statistics by Webuye, Webuye West and then Webuye zinafuata Bumula the worst is Webuye East but the worst does not mean that you are not doing well you are just a dwarf among other dwarfs so you need to we need to get off that tag completely But when I saw people dancing here I understand sometimes you know Bungoma has been leading in very many things. Hii Bungoma ndiye yuko na Yesu wa Tongareni. Hii Bungoma ndiye ilikuwa na mtu wa kwanza kupanda kwa chopa abebwe kwenda nayo. Hii Bungoma ndiye ilikuwa ya kwanza when they posted Cuban doctors to come here after two weeks the mzungu had already been married by Abukuzu. Hii Bungoma tuko na mambo mazuri pia. Hii Bungoma pia ndio tume produce the first cardinal called Cardinal Moses Otunga who is becoming a saint. Hii Bungoma ndio pia imeproduce the first archbishop kutoka upande wa Anglican called wa Bukala. Okay, hii saizi Catholics tuko na Bishop Anyolo. So we are leading in many things but let us reduce the bad ones so that we lead kwa ile mambo mazuri. This one I'll call for collective uh, assistance. So as I conclude